you watch Hunter Mile Drive and today I decided to record a video about this Porsche 911 Carrera base with all the extra options that it has and you'll be amazed the things that Porsche is charging for. Get this, this base price of this car is $101,200. The out the door price is $126,420. So this car has $25,000 worth of options. So I'm gonna run you through some of these options from this list and you'll be amazed some of the things that Porsche is charging for. Let's start with this beautiful shark blue color and this will cost you $3,270. You'll notice there are not many Porsche blue color like this on the road because not many people are ready to pay premium for this color. Now next goes standard interior in black including leather seats. That is the $0 option so thank you Porsche for not charging for standard seats. As you can see, this has just a regular black uh, interior, black seats. Now, next we'll go extended range fuel tank, 23.7 gallons, and that is $230. I would absolutely pay for that because I think it's totally worth it. Now, sport tailpipes in black, $950. So let's look at them. So this car does not have sport exhaust package. Instead, it just has this quad exhaust tips and you know they are painted in black and you paying extra for this $950. I would personally pay for this because I think it makes this car look really really good. Now next GT Sport steering wheel in race tax. Let's look into this. Now this is like a GT Sport wheel. Now while I think it looks great uh, this is like a Alcantara version of the you know Porsche but to me, I can see some wear on the steering wheel. So I probably would stay with standard steering wheel because Porsche charging $520 for this. Now, wheels painted in satin black. This is a $600 option. So let's look at this. These are RS Spider wheels. I'm gonna announce in a moment how much they cost. But just for you to have this in black, Porsche will charge you extra $600 just to have them painted in black. Now, next thing is funny, the 911 logo on the rear in high gloss black. Again, you want this 911 logo? Huh, because this one is black, right? But you want this to be also black? You gotta pay for this, my friend. And this is $160. Would I pay for this? Maybe I would, just to have it look nice. Now, Porsche Crest on headrest front, that'll cost you $290. Now, would I pay for that? I'm not sure, it's a little dark here, but basically Porsche's crest on the headrest on these two seats. The next thing we're gonna look at these beautiful RS Spider design wheels. Now let's look at the rear one. This is staggered wheels, front are 20s, the rear are 21s. And these are by the way, 305 wide wheels. And this will cost you $3,740. Would I pay for that? Yes, <clears throat> because I like how they look. They look fantastic, but imagine you also have to pay, if you remember, $600 extra for them to be black. So <laughs> that is like $4,340. Now, ventilated seats front, $840. That is up to you. I probably would buy them. Now, center console lid in race tax with Porsche logo, $340. So basically, for you to have this center console cover to be in that race tax material and say Porsche on it, you will pay $340. Would I pay for that? Probably not. Now, this is the where it gets really funny. Exterior meters in exterior color and high gloss black, $660. So now it's this thing right here. These are the meters. So for you to have this painted in black, not just exterior color, you're gonna pay $660 extra. So Porsche is very creative here. So how they can make money. Now, this is the most funny option, the why I decided to record this video. And that is power folding exterior meters, $370. So you want your Porsche to fold meters like this? Huh, it's not free. It's at all not free. You have to pay $370. Since it's like not a lot, you probably would pay for it, right? So that's how Porsche makes $370 extra. Now, the next one is 
interior trim inlays in exterior color 1260 so you got your exterior in blue right you thought you were done but you are not done so you want some interior pieces to be in blue as well starting from here blue some blue here some blue where the cup holder is some more in the dash trim and that is one thousand two hundred and sixty dollars so this is gets me thinking like wow how much more are you gonna spend on the porsche now this is another funny one center tachometer in white oh actually it's this one center tachometer right here in the middle that's painted in white you want that in white 420 dollars please okay please 420 dollars now this car also equipped with sport chrono package that's how you get that tachometer and uh, basically that clock in the middle this will run you two thousand and seven hundred and ninety dollars you also get increased zero to sixty which will start from uh it'll do it in 3.8 seconds versus four seconds i would personally get that chrono package next exclusive design tail lights let's look at the tail lights let me actually start this car oh it sounds fantastic i love how this car sounds so this apparently has some designer tail lights i personally thought all of them looked the same apparently they don't look the same so whatever the design is here that'll cost you 990 dollars okay now this also comes with smoking package that is zero dollars so thank you porsche for not charging for that they give you a little plastic piece i believe this is what it is so let me stop this so they give you this i guess for your cigarettes butts and this is free so at least we get something free from porsche the next thing is the bose surround system so you see some bose speakers here you see speakers underneath this kind of center piece here there are more speakers throughout the cabin and let me tell you this it's absolutely worth it it's absolutely worth it because the sound in this car is amazing you probably don't have to spend five six k on that burns burnerstein sound but at least get this bose sound because sound insulation in this car is not good and when you listen to loud music it kind of offsets the road noise and everything and the sound in this car sounds really good also because of the shape of this car so totally worth it next is motorsport stripe decal on top in black so i presume it's this stripe right here and this will cost you 680 dollars and probably this as well i don't know if, i don't see it being separate but basically to put those stripes they'll charge you 680 dollars now porsche logo decal on the side in black let's look at the side porsche decals this will cost you 560 dollars extra it is there on both sides all right and now when you thought you got a blue porsche you are done spending money on it well what if you want seat belts to be in blue as well well this will cost you another 540 dollars look at this these seat belts don't they look gorgeous and don't you want blue seat belts of course you want so please you have to pay 540 dollars and now porsche logo on rear in high gloss black okay i presume it's this this is what i see now so this to be in black along with your 911 decal that'll cost you 300 dollars now sport seats plus four ways so this car basically basically this base seat which you also pay by the way 300 dollars extra uh no sorry 810 dollars okay you still pay so that your seats are somewhat automatic they can go up uh they can you know the rear side this can uh, go forward and back but you can you have to still pull it forward and back with this manual lever here and honestly i like it because i think in sports car it doesn't have to be all automatic i actually like to be able to quickly adjust my seat but anyway you have to pay 810 dollars for for that now storage package is zero dollars window trim in high gloss black 
and ten dollars window trim is this trim right here 510 dollars if you want your porsche to look more crisp and kind of match with your wheels you kind of want to spend another 510 dollars ambient lighting 580 dollars now i finally found what ambient lighting in porsche is it's basically some of the lights that come from the bottom let me go ahead and i'm not going to start the car but i'll engage it a little bit the ignition here or maybe i have to start the car so we can see the ambient lighting right uh, well you can't really see it that much there's some little lights not these ones there's a little light here this one in the middle there will be some lights down there and then there will be some in the doors and um, I haven't played around too much with this car but you can probably adjust the color maybe not I'm not sure about that but that's basically extra otherwise what your car will be all dark inside right and next we have under door puddle light projections that is $160 those Porsche projections there that's $160 I would probably pay for that and now next thing is sport chrono stopwatch dial in white let me stop this car it sounds really loud oh but you can see it right here see this white around here that is also extra so you paid for your tachometer white you want it to match with this chrono well this will cost you 420 dollars all right so basically everything else is included uh, which is your first year maintenance is included um, and no sunroof it says on this paper that there is no sunroof because you didn't have enough money you spent all your money on these decals these wheels so now you could not afford to get a sunroof on this car and that's it so guys i hope you found value and found what it really looks like to spec a car i think this car spec really well uh, but porsche just i think over delivers in terms of their upsells i hope you enjoyed this video let me know what you think how would you spec your porsche and i'll catch you in the next video